Hey y'all, it's Thrifty Tiffany and I am back with a Walmart haul. So this is an unexpected Walmart haul. Kaya is sick and it's going around her whole school. So we think it might be the flu. It's definitely pretty rough for her right now. So I had to run to Walmart, get some things to cook. So I wanted to cook the soup that you get when you go to get hibachi. So I was gonna make that clear liquid soup and I got all the ingredients. I looked up the recipe, I got all the ingredients and then later tonight I'll be making chicken fried rice. So it's kind of gonna be like hibachi today but I wanted to go ahead and get the soup cooking for Kaya today. I might film that. Um, I probably will. I'll probably film me cooking that because it's pretty simple. But so I had to go run to Walmart, get some things that we needed as far as for the soup, ingredients, and then just some things that she can eat while she's sick. Hopefully this doesn't go through our whole house, but it could. But again, it's looking like the flu. When I checked her out of school yesterday, the lady in the attendance office said it's going around like crazy. It's definitely flu season. So I picked up some things. I already had some things. And I also wanted to update you guys on my towels situation. Some items that I picked up at Walmart yesterday to um, wash the towels. So I wanted to share with, we'll, we'll start with that first. So I went to Walmart, a lot of you guys said vinegar. So these are some things I purchased yesterday. Vinegar, and that was like the biggest vinegar. And it's not the washing machine because all of our other clothes come out just fine. It's literally just the towels. So I know it's from the boys or just, just from the towels sitting or I'm not sure. But these are the products that I got. So first things first, I found this. It's called Out Pro Wash. It's for workwear and it's odor eliminator detergent. It's for perspiration, musty smells, cooking odors, and smoke. So it's for that, but I thought, why not towels? So I put a little cap of this and then I found this OxyClean and this is the odor blasters and it's for sweat, musty towels, and body odor. And that's literally what it says right there. So I did a scoop of this, a little cap of this, and then I found Clorox Laundry Sanitizer, and this has no bleach in it, um, and it kills bacteria in laundry, and I, it shows towels here, so I just thought I would get a sanitizer as well. And then of course, the classic, you can see I've already went through some, white vinegar. So everyone said it doesn't make your towel smell like vinegar, just use it, and they're right. It does not make your towel smell like vinegar. So what I did was I hot a setting like I've been doing. I put the I put all this stuff in there plus the laundry detergent and I let it sit there and didn't shut the lid. So I let it soak for about 30 minutes in this whole mixture in very hot water. Then I closed the lid and let it start the wash. Did one cycle and then I just did a rinse hot cycle a second time and then washed it so they don't smell. So thank you guys. I, I found all these other things. I know I probably didn't need to buy everything but this, but I just looked in that section and couldn't believe I found all this stuff. So that's what we did and that's what I'll be doing from here on out so we won't have musty towels. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for that on my other video. I was asking questions. Oh, y'all, I look rough. <laughs> This is how I'm just gonna look for today. Um, I have Pilates scheduled, but I canceled it to take care of her and go run to the grocery store and get everything that we needed so I can start cooking and just getting everything together. And Fela is right here beside me. Fela, you wanna say hey before I start in my haul? It's gonna be a little chatty hard. You wanna say hey to everybody? He needs a haircut, y'all. He's getting a haircut on the 17th. Look, Fela, say hey to everyone. Say hey. Is Kiki sick? Yes, y'all, I call Kaya Kiki. Is Kiki sick? Yeah? Her sick, but he looks sad. Smile, fella Bobella. Smile to everyone. Okay, let me show y'all what I got though. Okay, first things first, she she doesn't like hot tea. So I'm like, hot tea, coffee's not really good for her to have right now while she's sick. Um, and she does not like to drink Theraflu, but it really makes you feel better. Um, so I got apple cider. We're gonna try some hot, warm apple cider and see if that helps her. I did not, this is caramel. I didn't realize it said caramel on there. Maybe she'll like that, I don't know, but I was just trying to get just plain apple cider. Oh well, limited time only, it's caramel apple cider, so weird, and maybe it's better. We'll try that and I'll put a little cinnamon stick in it and we'll try that. So I'm thinking more like warm juices maybe. I don't know, she doesn't like. Got tissue, y'all I did not realize they had the Scotty's brand at um, Walmart and it's cheaper than $1.25, which they're at Dollar Tree now but they had my favorite like wood chevron type look, whatever you call that. 
Um, so I got two of these and these are the soft 110. How much were they? They were like $1.12. So I picked those up. Needed tissues, definitely needed tissues. Um, I picked up Kaya some bagels. She likes to have bagels. So maybe when she gets up to it, she can have a bagel. And I got bagel thins also. Again, I had to pick up a couple things that we already needed. These bagel thins are so good. I make salmon bagels with them and they're so good. Um, saltine crackers, gotta have saltine crackers. This morning we didn't have any, so I gave her pretzel thins. Um, and those, she just needed something dry. Her stomach didn't feel, she felt nauseated, but I think it's because she took medicine on empty stomach. So I told her don't do that again. Um, we got just saltine crackers and those are like a buck, y'all. Okay, I found this. So I remember Dollar Tree getting a shipment of the little pads that go in here. They're like these pads. They're like little pads. They've had, they had them at one time. These, they run for like $8. This little thing was $12 and it says a waterless tabletop vaporizer releases soothing menthol vapors waterless no spills no refilling silent operation and it includes these little pads right here these are the pads dollar tree has well they got a shipment of I'm, i need to see now that i got it i need to go see if they have some more but it comes with five and this thing was twelve dollars so i'm gonna put this in her room and this is so convenient so whoever's sick just put it in their room and have this going and you can also have it going when you take a shower they also have shower steamers that you put little tablets that you put in the shower when you're taking a shower but this is like reusable so yeah we can do that we can try that again that was worth it i got onions for the soup because you need some onions and so you cut all the vegetables that you need in chunks so you boil it and let it simmer for a long time and then when you go to serve the clear liquid soup you take all that big stuff out um and i got some of these I got cream of chicken and herbs because I needed to stock up. Look, I love the cream of chicken and herbs. When I made mushroom chicken the other night, I used some. It was roasted garlic and cream of chicken. It was so good. But um, where are they at? So I got two of the cream of chicken and herbs. And then I stocked up on cream of chicken, just regular cream of chicken to have. You're always going to need these to cook with y'all, especially during the seasons of making soups and casseroles and Thanksgiving and all that and then I got two cream of mushroom I looked for the four pack they didn't have it so that's what I used fell you on my bags again what's this okay I got some oven roasted turkey spam y'all this is actually good with some white rice very good and eggs um I got apple cinnamon rice cakes these are just a good dry we eat these all the time anyway but they're a good dry thing to have when you don't feel good you need to have like crackers dry stuff so you don't throw up or anything like that so I got those, got her, she requested the Frost Gatorade. I got her a bunch of those to so stay hydrated. Also, I have Powerade popsicles that I got from Dollar Tree. She's already had some of those this morning, so those work well. I got mushrooms for the clear soup, a bunch of green onions for the clear soup, and it actually has ginger in that soup. So I got a big thing of ginger. And then I'm gonna make a big pot, y'all, and I got garlic i found these i was gonna snack on them on the way home but didn't get a chance to these are the dots honey mustard ones these are so good i got her some instant grits i have regular grits that i buy from dollar tree but these are quick fast and you can use the cure rig to get the hot water out of the cure rig and this and it makes it real quick and i'll show you where's that right here these cups that i showed from dollar tree you'll see some grits in there i made her some before i left and she ate most of it but um you just put two packets in here, put it in here, set it under the cure rig and use a scalding hot water and make you a cup. You can do that with oatmeal. And that's why I love these. These are gonna come in handy when your kids are sick or you're sick for soups, oatmeals, grits, stuff like that. Um, so I use that. I got, these look good. This is brown sugar and cinnamon cream cheese for the bagel and strawberry. So I got those two and these are Walmart brand. Then I got some beef broth and chicken broth you use both of these to make the soup that's going to be a lot of liquid i'm going to put it in my dutch oven i needed some maraschino cherries i just like to keep these on hand this is good to mix in drinks i needed creamer i got the natural bliss and i got some uh, jasmine rice i think i have the one i got from trader joe's but i was not sure so i just picked it up anyway um this is just the great value jasmine rice 
and I found these. This is real random, but fried sweet plantains. Y'all, I'm obsessed with plantains. I love them, and I wanted to try this, so I picked it up. This is like two bucks. Got some protein bars. We needed some, and these are really, really good. The maple glazed donut ones. Woo, honey, they're so good. I got peas and carrots for the chicken fried rice tonight. And then I needed some turkey sausage, turkey breakfast sausage. So I picked that up. And then she requested some jello. So I got I got her the lemon lime jello. And then I needed some sesame oil for the um soup. You gotta use it for the soup. You like saute the onions and stuff like that and then you pour in the broth and yeah hopefully i'll film it not sure i'll try to film it y'all i'll try to film it but um thank you guys so much that is it for the haul thank you guys for letting me know about the towel situation the laundry stuff i found a bunch of new stuff but the vinegar and everything did help so thank you so much for that and y'all stay well and healthy because it is flu season and it is out there and these poor kids in these schools Literally, the lady told me at the school, she was like, half the school is out. So, it was she was bound to get it eventually. Um, and so, she is definitely sick. I feel so bad for her. She had a rough night last night. But hopefully, this Vic starts. And hopefully, we all don't get sick. I'm trying to keep her in her room and the boys in their room <laughs> and me in my room. But um, hopefully, she gets through it through the weekend and then we'll be good to go Monday. Fingers crossed. But thank you guys so much for watching. Look at my hair. Y'all look at this. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you on my next video. Bye, y'all. Love y'all.